me off. And so it's what? Nothing right now. My mom has cut me off. Nothing? Completely. Yeah, I'm just living off brand deals right now. And then I get my AdSense like in a month. So you're, you're still getting a lot of money. That's mm-hmm. pretty much. Yeah, but I don't need my mom anymore. How is everything since Dr. Phil? I feel like I should ask that. It's been insane. I see that you have like Gerald. Gerald. Yes, Gerald. Gerald. Is Gerald the bag? Gerald. Gerald, Gerald. is her Celine luggage coat. It's right there. That's Gerald. You can bring it to us. Thank you. Oh my gosh, she makes it! The plebeian brought us a Gerald. The what? The plebeian. <laughs> can, I, can I see Gerald for a minute? Be careful. Can I dress him with Gerald? Can we? I Thank you. He's very okay. sensitive. We'll take your car if you drop him. So this is the mouth, I'm assuming. Mm-hmm. Yes. It, that's we feed Gerald through that. You are pinching the back. Um, oh, I'm sorry. Harshly. My bad. Am it's I okay. holding it up right? You can't smush him, please. And no floors either. So you saw the video. I was on YouTube, and then it came up in my recommended. Uh-huh. And then I watched it. He was watching it with me. Mm-hmm. And then I watched it, and... Um, it was alright. I told her. It was just alright. So, do you think you're a motivational speaker? I definitely am a motivational speaker. I'm changing people's lives. By the day. Stop being poor! You can't be poor. You can't be poor. If, if you're, you're poor, you just need to tell yourself you're to stop. Poor. So, it's you and Gerald, and it says me and my child, Gerald, and you're holding a. Gerald. What is that? Because you're, you're not 21, so. That is um, a wine glass filled with uh, marbles. No, it is an fact filled with marbles. I feel like I need to ask about the G Wagon. I think mm-hmm. everyone saw that you got your G Wagon. Yes. Can you even drive? No. I have my permit. She drives anyway. Who needs rules when you're rich? Yeah, I could just pay my way out of it. But this is your first car, so why start with such like a expensive car? Why not? Why not? If you can do like, it, why not? Okay. Within the next six months, we'll probably have like four different cars. But you still won't be able to like legally drive. No, she can drive in two months. Oh. Yeah. She does anyway. No, yeah, of course. Do you ever smile on a photo, by the way? No. Like, I feel like all of your photos, you just look like you're in She's not allowed to smile. She doesn't let her face know she's happy. What do you do in the morning? I usually start by ordering food for my stylist tonight. We usually start with smoothies or something very healthy. That's usual. Yeah. And then I wake up my stylist and I have him do my makeup. When you say your stylist, you mean him. Yes, he's my stylist. So he's my living stylist. You don't actually address him as like anything other than my stylist when he's right there? Well, he's my friend, but he's my stylist. I've also heard that you shut down stores. Oh yes, I could do that. Mm-hmm. So why? That, that <laughs> we can't shop with commoners. When she's in the building, she requires we can't shop with clubs. expensive. But you shop on like Melrose and Rodeo Drive, which I don't think that's commoners. Well, it doesn't matter. Commoners are still allowed to walk inside the store. Yeah, and she has to have the utmost security and the utmost luxury when in her presence. She requires it. So it's just to shut it down to shut it down, pretty much. Oh, pretty much. If you could do it, why not? I mean, <laughs> I mean if you could do it, When I he guess. walks in the store, they already shut it down because they know how high-profile his clients are. Mm-hmm. I get greeted by everyone. All the managers drop everything. They come and help us. They close down the stores. They serve us champagne and... Coke and water and all of that. We have food. There's always buffets. If we're spending a lot of money, they're gonna treat us well. And how much do you normally spend at a store? Anywhere between five and ten thousand dollars per day at one single store. And do you just choose one store for that day? Mm, not always. I'm trying to be more poor. So my shirt was sixty dollars. <laughs> okay. My shorts were a hundred. They're from Vineyard Vines. I'm not wearing shoes. Yeah. But I'm wearing Dolce & Gabbana underwear and it costs $300 and my belt is 1000 And my rings no, are wait, Whoa, whoa, stop, stop. That okay, belt, his rings equal to No, 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 we're not talking about the rings yet. The belt is 1000 Oh, yes. It's Hermes. It's Hermes. So this is 10 grand right here. <laughs> yeah. Can't try it on? It's not going to fit you. I have tiny fingers. Does that mean I get to keep it? No. No. Okay. I buy myself things when I hit like milestones and that's when I moved to LA, I bought that. So this jacket is Givenchy. We got it oh, in the Givenchy. video. Oh, Givenchy. Yes. Givenchy. This is 1500. We bought, we bought all of them so no one else can have them. Yeah. So your jeans look ugly. They're probably from Hollister, Abercrombie or some ugly store like that. And you're wearing Walmart socks. <laughs> I think those are actually Walmart socks. Yeah, and then, you know, your face. Okay. How would you change me? No, your outfit works well for you. Oh. It's good now? Mm-hmm. 
Like I said, I'm wearing poor people clothes too. Mm. <laughs> my outfit is only like thirteen yeah. grand if you include my jewelry, but it's like this, it's uh, like two or four, five, six hundred if you include my underwear. <laughs> so you know, I'm wearing uh, poor people clothes. So that works for you. All right. Well, how would you dress him if you were going to dress him like you dress me? Yeah, mm-hmm. just tell me what you want on me. I can't imagine you in anything expensive. 